Welcome to this introduction to Preparative HPLC and the LH40 Liquid Handler. In this video, we'll explore key concepts in fraction collection and sample injection techniques, focusing on how the LH40 enhances efficiency and precision in preparative chromatography. Firstly, I will share additional notes on preparative HPLC. Then we will look at LH40's features and procedures. Lastly, we can then discuss the different functions of the LH40. Preparative HPLC is a technique used to separate and collect target compounds from a mixture at a larger scale, as shown here with them. Separation of blue, red, and yellow fractions. Analytical and preparative liquid chromatography serve different purposes. Analytical LC focuses on separating and identifying analytes for qualitative and quantitative analysis using small injection volumes, low flow rates, and high pressure columns. In contrast, preparative LC is designed for purification and collection of target analytes, employing larger injection volumes, higher flow rates, and fraction collectors. Controlling the sample solvent's elution strength is vital for achieving sharp, well-resolved peaks. A strong elution power can be problematic, particularly with large injection volumes, so optimizing sample solvent composition is key to maintaining chromatographic performance. Another item to take note is the column temperature effect. It is important to take note of the column temperature because of its impact on peak quality. This tends to happen when either there is a large temperature difference between the column oven and the mobile phase, a column with a large internal diameter is used, or the flow rate of the mobile phase is high. When there's a difference in temperature between the mobile phase entering the column and the column's oven temperature, a gradient can form. This gradient can affect the consistency of analyte interactions with the stationary phase. Moving on, we will look into LH40 features and operations. LH40, also known as the liquid handler, is a unit that acts as both the auto sampler and the fraction collector. This gives it the ability to perform complex instructions that the FRC40 and FRC108 lack, such as purity checks. It also holds a proprietary injection method that minimizes carryover to minuscule amounts that will greatly suppress contamination. The full feature set of the LH40 is shown here. This includes various features like automatic generation of fraction collection methods, a sample rescue function, prevention of fraction overflow, capability of up to four detector signal input channels, and extensive functionality for inhibiting contamination. Most notably, the liquid handler's strength in its speed and efficiency through all these features are its advantage over the other fraction. As stated in previous parts, the LH40 can perform purity checks. This allows for increased throughput and reduced workload as the purity check can be done without changing the fraction recovery container. The diagram above shows the purity comparison of the individual components, shown as various colors, to its total sample, shown as black. Overall, the LH40 is the ultimate option to suit all the needs of a chemist in their preparative work. Next, we will discuss the workflow to develop an LH40 preparative method. The general workflow of the scale up of analytical to preparative methods is the same, but the additional step of purity checks is included when using the LH40. Firstly, we would develop an analytical LC method, scale it up to become a preparative LC method, optimize the LC method, and then develop the fraction collection method. After all that, we would collect fractions to re-inject for purity checks. Functions that assist in this workflow are, one, the fractionation simulation to quickly produce a fractionation method, two, the preparative parameter auto-generation to further accelerate the creation of a preparative method. Three, the preparative parameter improvement to enhance the preparative. Method four, the sample rescue in case of error to save precious samples. 
and 5, the parameter adjustment in the sequence window to showcase all settings for complete control of the method. When developing the fractionation method, the simulation function will assist in auto-generating the method. The auto-generated method can then be fine-tuned to suit the chemist's purity needs. It can be adjusted through the different parameters available in the lab solution software. Additionally, Shimatsu's noise skipping algorithm will prevent any noise from being detected that can waste fraction tubes and vials. This algorithm can be adjusted through the peak sensitivity setting. Such an algorithm greatly saves chemists' time. As chemists worldwide know, we cannot afford to lose precious samples. The sample rescue function will be a lifesaver for when a chemist experiences a possible fractionation mistake. With such a function, a chemist can be free from any worries about system errors. Thanks for watching this introduction to Preparative HPLC and the LH40 liquid handler. If you found this video helpful, stay tuned for more insights into chromatography innovations. Excellence in science, Shimazu.